Retro Rock plays everything. Hey there real gamers and gatekeepers, Retro Rob here and today we're going to be looking at a game on the Super Cassette Vision. Super Cassette Vision was only released in Japan and actually, well, it had limited releases in other areas, but it was mostly a Japanese game system. It was a sequel to the original Cassette Vision. This was made in 1984 and was originally meant to do battle with the Nintendo Entertainment System. Believe it or not, it actually stood a good chance because the original Cassette Vision had done so well, uh, but Nintendo's licensing programs really, really, or licensing uh, habits really did a lot of damage on the Super Cassette Vision, uh, which you'll see over time. By the way, I do have a video dedicated to the Super Cassette Vision as opposed to one specific game on it, and you can check that out. I'll put a link down below. But let's start with today's game, and that game is Wheelie Racer. For those of you who are into that kind of thing, this is game number 10 and uh, the Super Cassette Vision did have them numbered for the most part. I think later ones uh, did not have that but this one's number 10. And this is the back of the box which I can't really say much about because I can't read any of this. <laughs> that said I can read 1985 Epoch Company Limited uh, but everything else is uh, well What's saying? It's Greek to me, but it's Japanese to me. Anyway, you could be forgiven for thinking that this is a bump and jump clone because a lot of the games that are on here were originally started as licensed games and lost their licensing due to Nintendo. But this is not. This is a rally game. It's quite a bit different from bump and jump in its overall scope and goals. And you'll see that in a minute because we're going to start playing momentarily. And before we get playing, first thing I want to show you is how interesting these boxes are. Look at that. How cool is that? The way it opens. Pull the cartridge out. Uh, very often there is an instruction manual. Unfortunately, most of my games don't have them. This one's no exception. They do come in a rainbow of colors. Wheelie Racer is red. There's the instructions. Can anybody read them? Hmm? Hmm? All right, let's get playing. Thumbs up, comment, and subscribe, or I will go Skynet on your butt. And now it's time for some Wheelie Racer gameplay. I'm going to hit Enter to start the game, and of course I'm going to select Pro Mode, which is number two, because I'm a professional gamer. Abs uh, you know, it totally flashes the one that I'm not picking. Yeah. Okay. Right button accelerates, left button brakes, pull down, does like a jump boost type of thing. And here we go. Let's do this. I'm jump boosting right now. All right, so a couple things on the left. There is your score. Below that is that AMA eight. That's how many cars I have left. Once I'm out of cars, the race is over. Below that is my fuel gauge. Oh shoot, I'm gonna crash. It's going down to seven. All right, below that is my fuel gauge. This is not one of those games where you can actually sit there and talk while you're playing. You gotta kind of focus on it. But anyway, below that is my fuel gauge. Uh, below that is my speed. And then finally, my rank. And of course, I want to be first. Right now, I'm 69th. This is not a uh, game where you want to keep the pedal to the metal the entire time. Oh, I hate these trucks. Uh, it's a game where you're going to basically slowly plod your way forward while avoiding those really annoying pink trucks. I really absolutely hate those trucks. It's really, I hate them. There we go. You cannot go off the road or you will crash. Ugh. And water is probably the worst hazard in the game. You can jump over most of the other stuff. I don't think you can jump over water. Maybe I'll try it if I'm feeling risky later. Look at the cows on the right side. A lot of detail in this. Oh, crap. There we go. Oh, yeah, I made it. I made it. 
absolutely hate the computer control cars. They definitely want to run into you. This is more like Speed Racer than it is like anything else. All right, move it. And notice how the terrain does, oh, that's not good, there we go. Notice how the terrain does absolutely nothing to them. I have complaints. That said, the game itself is pretty great. Um, the controls work pretty well. I have no problem with those. The acceleration, it's, you know, it, it, the acceleration isn't really uh, very fast. It takes you a while to get up to speed. And strangely, after the first race, it seems like your car slows down. There we go. Just made it. We're in NYC. I'm going to assume that's New York City. And uh, we have challenged America successfully. Now we're going to Africa. Notice how my rank stays the same. I'm 53rd. So the race goes cross continents. I'm trying to remember. There was a there was a game. I think it was by Electronic Arts called like the Great American Road Race or something. And I I think this is a little bit based on that enduro and just a little bit of bump and jump. Oh. Now you see how I just jumped over that rock? Very useful thing to know. And notice how I hit that truck and did not absolutely die. It's because I'm going slow. Oh, I hate this truck. I hate these trucks. And that's super important because otherwise I'd have got wiped out there. Did... Uh, I, that's not going to be good. Well, at least I didn't die. It cost me some position, but... Alright, pulled forward. Now I'm past him. Remember, just take, take your time. Just saying. I love the way that truck like will shift like right over to get you. Big jerk. Look at him. Look at him. Like he just wants to hit me. There's a reason for road rage right there. One thing I really like, though, is uh, you can see the variety of graphics and backgrounds and such, and there's even, like, night and day. I think that's really cool. Like, you can actually tell one area from the other. Oh, come on now. There we go. Again, I could jump those rocks, but you're taking a bit of a risk when you do it. So I try not to do it too often. I say as I uh, continue to jump over them. All right, there should be gas over here, I would think. Yep, there we go. Thirty second. Again, look at all this variety. Oh, we're gonna hit the. Are we gonna hit the water area? Yep, the bog. Yeah, look at how, look at how, you see that crap? That's the kind of crap you gotta put up with. Lost a car to that. Bunch of jerks. And now I have like a significant disadvantage because their cars of course ignore the terrain, but mine doesn't. So long, sucker. I gotta get some gas, because I probably used it all up. There we go. Look at the way he just goes all the way across the road to get at me. What a big jerk. Out of my way. Oh! Yeah, that was almost fatal. It was not, however. You should get, like, double points 
for passing those trucks because they're such jerks. That's it. I beat Africa. Africa's done. Now it's time for all of Europe. That's right. I'm challenging all of Europe. I only need to gain 24 places. And if I drive real carefully, I might even lift... Oh, don't... What the heck? You see that? I was going slow. And I was ahead of him. Oh, man. That's so frustrating. So frustrating. Come Unbelievable. Unbelievable. I really hate those pink trucks. I really hate them. You see how I just crashed twice in a row, just kind of dashing my hopes upon the rocks of this game. No, get out of my way, you big green bugger. Come on! No, no, you're getting out of the way. Ugh. I mean, really? I did what? They drive this bad? <laughs> so I've just lost three lives just trying to pass one guy. You know? <laughs> Unbelievable. No. Goodbye. Out of my way, truck. It's like truck after truck. Oh, ridiculous. It's truck after truck after truck. I don't know, guys. I'm in 19th place right now. I don't know that I'm going to make it much further. It's just getting rough. They keep putting truck after truck, and then when I finally get into a spot where I can maybe pass some people, <laughs> there's a bunch of logs. In the Whose highway is this? And it didn't jump it. And I, this is my last life, and it looks like I'm stuck right in front of a log. That's pretty bad there. All right, here we go. <laughs> I'm so worried now. 17th. Get away. What? Broken down car in the middle of the road. That better not explode me. It did. Unbelievable. And that's it for Wheelie Racer for the Super Cassette Vision. I believe it's one of the better games on the system, and I'm pretty sure it's the only racing game available on the system as well. So if you're going to only make one game of that genre, you might as well do it right. Uh, neat little rally game. I, it was good enough that it frustrated me where things went wrong. And I think that's usually a sign that it's a pretty decent game. So I do like it. I'm going to give it a thumbs up. I want to thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. Subscribe for more, and I'll see you in a couple days. Bye.